Speeder man. So I have this MS 462 that I'm rebuilding. I'm getting back together, uh, but I'm not talking about that right now. I still got some fixing to do on it. The guy abuses them pretty hard. Um, so seeing that, we started playing around with new bars because the cost of bars, he's dropped them from trees, they burned them up, they run them out of oil. So it's too expensive to do a steel and chain. So we swapped over to this company, 810 24, 810. That's the company's name. This is a 24 inch bar. Okay. This is a 0 .50, 84 links, pitch is 3 8. Of course, all variants on the saw, you know, what you're putting on the application. But I got to say, he's been running them in the field, and on this MS 271, he, uh, he didn't have his bar plate on there, didn't get oil to it, overheated the clutch, as you can see, overheated the bar and the tip, and the chain and the bar did not give up. So I put it on another saw. It actually fit on a 461. It's a 20-inch, and he's running that, and then we want to try the 24-inch. I, on my MS290 converted to a 310 Frankenweiner, I'm running the 20-inch. I love it. I haven't really cut with it yet, but it running it dry, running it with oil, sounds good. Runs nice and true, chain don't jump off. I think for the bang for the buck in Amazon and the quick shipping, I think it's worth it. Worth it. This 24 inch, I think, came in at 67 bucks, where you can find it on sale. Plus, it's free shipping. Plus, I love the company. You've got an issue with it. Pack it back up, send it to them, and they take returns. No questions asked. They're really good to work with. So, 810, try them out. See what you think. And I'll post your reviews and tell me what you think. But I think it's a good buy for the bank for buck. Henry the Weed Eater Man out. And I don't get paid to advertise for these company. I just want to give you a cheaper but long-lasting product that you as the customer can use. I like the, the tooth. You look how long it is. So you've got a lot of times you can cut back on this. And so far, he says it's been holding the edge. Of course, you don't hit dirt. Um, but it's been holding up really well. Like I said, he, he tried to overheat it and kept on going. So anyways, tell me what you think. All right. Henry, the weed eater man, and I'm out.